so welcome to sony's world guys so today's video is actually a review based on hope in a jar that is from um so philosophy and influencers decided to give me a sample of this amazing product um that is from it's called hope in a jar and it's from philosophy so they gave this to a lot of people and they kept us to keep this a secret to um january 1st so now we could actually talk about it i'm gonna give you guys my honest review about this um how it works with my skin first of anything i'm gonna talk about the ingredients that this has and summarize it for you. so guys the first the first ingredient is pineapple extract it helps to in it fulminate the face it helps to take off all that dead skin so the next one is witch hazel water it helps to make your pore very um invisible so it says here minimize that's the way they use it and to um refresh the skin so yeah and then the other one is corn flower extract sorry i'm trying to read this very correctly and it helps with the redness see my redness have come down a lot because i used to get very red like i don't know why my skin does that okay so this says here is a boost of technology clean vegan formula and na, 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 na. it helps to smooth and polish your skin so that's mostly what it does it helps like with the redness with polishes polishing bleh. Probably making your face like glowy and polished honestly in my life so now i'm gonna show you the bottle and then i will explain to you guys how this went with my face so the packaging comes really nice it comes in here really good size i'm not gonna lie for a bottle for this is called a hope in a jar and it has b5 so mira mira so all right y'all i'm gonna take it out i'm gonna take it out let me show you guys the the formula in it now we're gonna put this in my hand and we're gonna use my hand as the a little dot because I don't want to use too much so we rub it like rub it there and I'm explaining now how to do this too but I'm gonna show you how much see how you can see the the, the dead skin coming off I feel it I'm gonna try and get closer. I have to keep on rubbing, 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 and you'll see. See the dead skin coming off. You have to rinse this out. So I'm gonna explain the next step. Anything, I'm explaining how to apply. It says to apply generously to clean dry skin. Massage it to up to a minute. Roll and rinse out for best results. Use it other day for three times per week or limit if you're very sensitive you have to limit it like you can't be doing it three three times per week so i'm letting you guys know that's what it says oh see see guys see see you see how that came off <laughs> okay so you have to gently do circle motions like that for a minute this is a suggestion that the website is giving you this is actually from um sephora so they're giving you the suggestion and to best results just rinse it out guys rinse it out um this is pretty cool i like in this so i'm explaining now how it affects my face but i'm gonna wash this off so now i'm explaining to you guys what it did to my skin it worked really good because i always have redness in my cheeks especially it did give me that glow it did do everything that support it says here they're supposed to do so it did work i'm not gonna lie i love the formula i love how it works i think i'm very sensitive to wish hazel because i've used wish hazel water before and it always gives me that little brain sensation no sé por qué, but always always been sensitive to it um when i used it everything was fine but like maybe the second day i felt the little bit like a brain sensation in my skin so it does say there you know precautions they it tells you there to use it maybe limit yourself of using this like three times per week so you have to limit it for yourself so i'm gonna maybe use this i'm gonna leave this for a more like a while 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 just in case i don't want to like 
mess up my skin. I don't want to like, you know, have a reaction to it. So this is why if I'm going to read, I already did this two weeks ago. I might take maybe, maybe like a month to reuse this for me personally. This is a personal thing. Would I recommend this to someone? Yeah, I would. Just please be careful, you know, like read the ingredients if you're allergic to it or anything. Just to make sure you're sensitive to any ingredients that this has. But it works how it says. I don't have no complaint, only that. Um, honestly, it did what it said. It made me glow, it made me, you know, look cute. And then I remember I used it two weeks ago, and then on New Year's, I still felt like it's still working. To me personally, it felt like it's still working. Um, but I like how the formula comes out. I like the packaging. I like everything. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. I really like the packaging this philosophy has with this. I really like it. It's very simple and easy. The you know, I like that. I like every ex everything. The box, how it came. And I like the way influencer and philosophy came together and did this um, very nicely. Honestly, I really like that. It's like a simple box. It came, let me show you how this came. Just like this. No, let's see the box I had because it came out really nice. And it like, it, it was closed when I got it, but look how nice it came. And then it tells you everything to be where because it has liquid in it. But honestly, I love it. I love the fact that it tells you what ingredient um, um explains to you everything behind the bottle. If you need to look for more information, actually Sephora and their website actually you know philosophy tells you too the ingredients, how to use it. And one, I want to say a big thank you to Philosophy and Instrument Influencer by sending me these products to test this product to test out. I had so much fun testing it out. I had so much keeping it as a secret. I really was really annoyed because I like telling, you know, everyone about this, but I had to keep a very deep secret to January 1st. And then I took my time to tell you guys anything because I wanted to make sure that they were okay with that. So I waited for, you know, philosophy to tell the news. So that's what I'm telling you guys now. And I really hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and put that bell to get more videos. And see you guys in the next one, guys. Thank you.